Freddie Spencer, I know that you're a regular at Goodwood at the Festival of Speed and the Revival. What, what brings you back every year? Well, it's just uh, such a unique event. I mean, what an incredible opportunity to ride bikes that have such history. I get such a kick. And again, what a privilege to be able to go back and ride a bike that, that uh, was so much a part of my racing career. Just tell us a little bit about what it feels like to, to ride a bike like this here at Goodwood. You try to be careful, but also show the actual spectators what it's like, the acceleration of a 500. And so it's a combination of you want to take it easy, these bikes are one off, but at the same time, get a little bit of that feeling, that sensation of what the bike can do. Forgive me for saying this, but I think I was eight when you won your World, world Championship. So it must be fun here we are sort of a quarter of a century later and all these people still asking for your autograph. I mean, that must be, give you a real thrill. Well, of course. And again, it's a privilege, really. Uh, and I've always felt that way to, to have them come up and they remember the first time they saw your race or they remember that feeling that inspired them to buy an Interceptor or, or to buy a bike. I appreciate so much each person that comes up and sharing that moment with them is really what it's all about. I think my mum said you're not having a motorbike. I think that was the message I got. Yeah, I've heard that a lot too, right? Because these bikes are known as being a, a, a bit of an animal, a bit of a handful. Absolutely. See, the, the interesting thing about two-stroke engines, you know, now in the MotoGP they run four strokes, but everybody talks about how difficult they were to ride. And they were, because even when you had great feel in this hand, I mean, I'd be going through sweepers and just give it a little throttle. I mean, just a tick of a throttle more. And the thing is, is because being carbureted in the two-stroke, the engine characteristics, it would react a little more than my throttle movement. So you're trying to anticipate that, and when it's raining and you can't see and you're running through a sweeper at 120 miles an hour and all you're trying to feel with that little bit of movement is control that, and that can turn into that. And you had to be so far ahead of what the bike was doing. Do you still get a buzz out of watching racing today? I've been around motorcycling over 40, 45 years, long time, right? And so I, I really respect and, and when I see something unique. And, and uh, I enjoy riding. I do, just like I did as a kid in my yard. I love to ride. Freddie, thank you for your time. Pleasure to meet you. Thank you. I really appreciate it.